is up guys i'm daddy gamer fred and welcome back to another pokemon sword and shield isle of armor dlc video in today's video we're going to be talking about magerna because magerna is not a pokemon from the pokemon sword and shield games it's not a pokemon from the isle of armor dlc expansion but somehow some way if you bring in any magerna from pokemon home it's allowed in it's like, what? Like, to me, this is pretty cool because, again, it's a Pokemon that's not on the Pokedex at all, regardless if you complete your Pokedex or not. And then, on top of that, in Pokemon Home, there is a way to get a shiny version of Magirna. That's, of course, if you have a full Living Dex inside of Home. Now, I currently don't have one. I'm still working on mine. And I got a few that I just need to get to kind of clear up um, things. But, again, if you do have a full Living Dex, you can bring in your shiny one. Of course, Joe Merrick from Sarah B. I'm going to have an image of his on the screen. Go follow him on Twitter and, you know, socials everywhere. is going to be in the description of this video. And, of course, he's flexing with his shiny Magarina inside of the Pokemon Sword and Shield games. Now, again, he was the, one of the first people i seen break this news. Obviously, he's Sarah B. But it's just one of those first people that i seen that actually showing Magarina inside of Pokemon Sword and Shield. It, to me, it's dope. It breaks that barrier in our brain that, hey, Pokemon that aren't in the Pokedex can't come through when there's probably a way they could probably squeeze these Pokemon through two of um, these games of course you know i had the gigantamax it i gotta see the dynamax version of this pokemon i gotta I gotta throw this baby up and see it huge i might not win this um raid battle but hey it's definitely worth it to see it in you know as a full dynamax again i wish i had the shiny version so i could showcase that as well but again this is pretty cool there we go so you guys can actually see Dynamax. Um, nothing is super um, effective on Zero Aura. Probably the worst Pokemon to do this against. But hey, let's go. I got into the to the match, and there she is. Let's go <laughs> inside a Pokemon Sword and Shield. I think this is pretty dope. Again, just for the fact that this is a Pokemon that, again, isn't in the Pokedex of Pokemon Sword and Shield and isn't in the Owl of Armor Pokedex, is not in the Crown Tundra Pokedex, but still managed to be allowed in. I think, again, the main reason why it is allowed in is because of the gift. If you complete your Pokemon Home Living Dex, you do get the shiny variant of Magirna, and I think that's why they're allowing Magirna in is because they want people who got that reward to actually use that Pokemon. And that just so happens that if you do have a regular Magirna, like I do, you can also bring that as well. I think this is pretty cool. Let me know your thoughts about this in the comment section below. It's kind of a weird stance because we, again, Pokemon Sword and Shield, they had a strong stance of like, no, if it's not catchable, you can't bring it in. But now they're letting us bring in. So, uh, like, to me, are the floodgates open? Are they not open? Let me know because I want to bring everybody. <laughs> but uh, I don't think we are going to um, bring everybody. Just let me know in the comment section below your thoughts of Magarina actually joining the Pokemon Sword and Shield roster, the Isle of Armor roster. Do you think it's pretty cool? Let's talk about it in the comments. As you guys know, I answer all comments, so let's have that conversation down there. If you're new around here, I do videos like this all the time, Pokemon discussion videos, and if you like the vibe, hit that subscribe button. Also, hit the like button. It does help me out a ton as far as moving the video into recommended so other people can check out the video. Peace. I love you guys. I'm going to see you guys on the next one. And if I do manage to win this raid with the Magirna, you will see the ending of the raid. But if not, then it's just going to end awkwardly right here.
thank you thank you thank you for making it to the end of this video if you're not a subscriber and you made it this far hit that subscribe button you know you want to join the family ring the bell so you can be notified on the next time i drop one of my videos as well as hit the like button on this video so it could be recommended so more people can check it out so we can have more people join in the family if you want to keep up with me on other social media platforms such as twitter instagram or tiktok or whatever i'm daddy gamer fred on all of those again daddy gamer fred you'll be able to find all those links in the description of this video and the pin tweet comment on my twitter also on all of my videos i do answer all comments so again if you just want to chat it up about the video or anything just hit me up in the comment section below i take time out of my day and literally answer to all the comments that you guys leave me and i love it and again let's have that conversation down there here are a couple of suggested videos that you guys should check out that may be of your interest i am a variety channel i do tons of stuff tons of pokemon but tons of other stuff as well so dive into these videos peace i love you guys i'm gonna see you guys on the next one